Cyclone Ragnarok. Giga Never. Versus Ultimate Valkyrie. Legacy Variable Dash. This Bayway Bell is the request, so I'm gonna put the comment right there that requested. Basically this is already a battle that I did, but they wanted me to do it again in like the like the more enemy accurate version instead of like what I thought would have been and Baylor vs. Quan Strike if Takara Tummy was in charge of it was in charge of it. And now let the battle begin. I really hope the camera angle is good and if it isn't then I'll try to um I'll try to fix it somehow. One way or another. Three, two, one, go shoot! Oh, and I forgot to mention that after I switch arenas, I'll actually switch between the Valkyries with the Variable Dash. I have one with the Warren Variable Dash, so that'll be different. Oh, wow. Ragnarok took all those hits. Ragnarok was that round with a spin finish. That was almost a burst finish, too. Round two, three, two, one, go shoot! See, this is why I don't launch Baylist on top of each other. Three, two, one, go shoot. Okay, now let's just hope that that last battle does never happen again. Like, I just don't want it to happen again. What's in Valkyrie doing his best? Ragnarok is pretty much on the defensive. And Ragnarok takes that round with a spin finish. Three, two, one, go shoot! Yeah, I can't really tail launch because if I tail launch, then the Beyblades will not act right. Oh wow! Did I count that as a burst finish or a spin finish? I have no idea. Three, two, one, go shoot! Okay, Ragnarok is in center again. I think I'll try to tilt launch the next round. Oh! I want to say that was a burst finish to Ultimate Valkyrie. Three, two, one, go shoot! Yeah, that's what happens when you, when you get to launch with a variable dash. It just wastes so much stamina and it doesn't even get anywhere. Ragnarok wins with a spin finish. It basically avoids all the attacks during the round, so it makes sense. Three, two, one, go shoot! Okay, let's see how Ragnarok will defend. Oh wow! Valkyrie wins that round with the overfinish. And now I'll switch arenas. Now it's a standard type stadium and I'm using the Warren Ultimate Valkyrie with the Warren Variable Dash. Okay, Ultimate Valkyrie wins that round with a spin finish. Three, two, one, go shoot! Okay, Valkyrie's trying to do the job. I want to say Ragnarok won, but I'm not entirely sure. Three, two, one, go shoot! Valkyrie just goes really crazy. <laughs> I also forgot to mention that this is basically um, Vault versus Ranzo. 
I think this actually did happen in the anime. I just don't remember at the moment. So, yeah. Let's see what happens. And Ragnarok wins that round with a spin finish. 3, 2, 1, go shoot. I'm trying so hard to tilt launch so that I don't waste all of Valkyrie's stamina, but I don't know. It really seems like tilt launching doesn't really help in general. Which is kind of sad, considering everything with Valkyrie. And Ragnarok wins that round with a spin finish. 3, 2, 1, go shoot! Go two. Yeah, this is exactly why I tilt launch, because if I don't tilt launch, then Valkyrie will just do this. I would stop it, but then again, I feel like that would kind of ruin my point of, um... My point of why I tilt launch Valkyrie, even though it scrapes a lot. And Ragnarok wins that round with a spin finish. 3, 2, 1, go shoot! Uh, okay. Ragnarok wins that round with an over finish. 3, 2, 1, go shoot! It's basically like, with every attack, Ragnarok just moves out of the way slightly. It actually means that Ragnarok is a good stamina type, I'd say. Even though it could burst at any moment. And it doesn't! Ragnarok wins that round with the spin finish. It was close to bursting. <laughs> if there was like one last tap, it would have bursted. 3, 2, 1, go shoot! Valkyrie wins that round with the over finish. 3, 2, 1, go shoot! Whoa! That was a lot of attacks. And if you heard something in the background, that's fireworks. So, yeah. Valkyrie's just holding on. Oh! That was a huge hit! And Ragnarok was that round with another burst limit spin finish. <sighs> I got it mixed up. Three, two, one, go shoot! Okay, this feels like an anime battle now. Whoa! Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. I think we, I think we got the point. I think we now understand that Ragnarok is really strong. And canonically, I mean, of course, in, in terms of the anime, Val will always win, but in terms of real life, Ranzo is the strongest. Also, thank you to the person that actually requested this video. I appreciate it. And another thing I want to say is that, um, is that I will be trying to do a lot more of the requests since I'm finally back home from being in Florida and going to the Beyblade premiere. Beyblade World Cup thing. Um, I'm looking forward to doing more of these requests and battles, so stay tuned for that. Okay, so I don't know who won, but I'll actually tell you the winner right now. Your winner is Cyclone Ragnarok. Giga, never. So, like if you want, share if you want, and subscribe to become a legend in the making. See you next time, bye, and we are proven to be legendary. Stay legendary.